Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini Limited Football. Seven box, half case, pick your team number 10. Second half of the case that we popped open a few nights ago. Big thanks everybody here for getting in on the action. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And those RNB stand for random number block. We did a number block randomizer. So it works just like our serial number breaks, but for those teams right there. All right, so let's see. I don't remember what happened in the first. What happened in the first half? I feel like we did pull something nice out of the first half. These are all base cards. Okay, what, what, what do we pull in that first half? Behind the Bridgewater to 149 is going to be the Relic only, Jacob Eason to 199. The other two should be autos. All right, then we got Mark Brunell, jersey and autograph, 30 out of 99. Seven, six, for the <laughs> John, you do this for free? I, I, I was like, you probably won the lottery then. Mark Brunell, oh, that's a number block team. So it goes to that digit right there, zero. So 30 out of 99, we go with zero. That's going to go to David Razor right up there. And we've got 22 out of 25, Antonio Gibson, three-color patch and autograph. That is for Peter and the Washington football team. Well, Jacob Eason appears a lot because because uh, he's Jacob Eason. You need the Jacob Easons because they can't all be Tua's, Brandon. They can't all be Joe Burrow's. Sometimes they got to be balanced out by some Jacob Easons. I think he was good. In, I want to say... I, I, don't follow college too closely, but I want to say he was decent in college. He got drafted by the Colts. So, so I mean, there's got to be some value there. All right, to 149, TJ Watt reveals a Dak Prescott. 35 out of 99. Got a nice, uh, got a nice little contract. Dallas is a number block team, so Dallas 5 is going to be Robert Runkel. Behind Melvin Gordon is Marquez Valdez-Scantling. 8 out of 10 autograph for the Packers. Jay with the pack. Behind Russell Gage is another hit for the Washington football team, Antonio Gibson. 7 out of 10, two-color patch and autograph, Peter. All right, yeah, Eric J is a Dolphins fan. He likes the cover of the box. Yeah, I got two on there. So what what what's the so since you're a Dolphins fan, Eric, what's the buzz? What's the buzz on, on on Tua? Are they are they keeping him? Are they trading him for someone else? 
Yeah, Washington is hot start for them. Two old rebound. Well, I mean, I don't think he did too too poorly for his first year coming off a, a, a major injury, surgery off a major injury. So behind the one out of 149, Kenyon Drake is the is the Keyshawn Vaughn, the Keyshawn Vaughn, 34 out of 199, Super Bowl champ. He's a Buccaneer that goes to Jay Goins. All right, behind Melvin Gordon is is a Dolphin, Brandon Jones, 10 out of 10. For the fish, that's for Roy and the Dolphins. All right, Eric's hoping and praying that he'll get weapons, get some O line, gets a full camp. Right, I, I forget about that. We forget about that too, right? That the rookies, rookie quarterbacks. I mean, you kind of need a full camp to really kind of meet your teammates. You know, like. And, and really just work on plays and stuff. And and some, that's just something you can't do over like Zoom calls and brief camps. Jerry Judy, rookie patch autographs, Ruby spotlight for Denver. Denver's a number block team, so that'll go to David Razor in the number zero. All right, see you, Josh. We'll see you next time. Josh Cherry saying he was a good QB at the Washington for the uh, Washington Huskies. Jacob Eason might have some upside with the college fans. Robert T saying keep the picks for Miami. You mean keep the picks? Get the old gang back together. They had a pretty good. They, had, they, they were pretty good last year. I feel like they're just another draft and a draft and free agent window away. Maybe this draft. Maybe this draft and a free agent window away. There's out of fifteen, Marvin Jones Jr. for Detroit. That'll be a number block team, and we've got Justin Jefferson. 72 out of 199 for the Vikings. That's also a number block team. That goes to Vikings 2. And we'll do a randomizer at the end for all the non-numbered base cards for the for those teams up here. There's DJ Dallas, 10 out of 99. <laughs> I don't I can't admit can't say that I know the uh, the Logan Allen market too well off the top of my head, Brandon. But I think if you do your research, and if you notice, this goes to Seattle, by the way, Hovsep. If you notice that, like, hey, that, that person, other similar cards have sold for a lot less, and that way you can kind of figure out what, the, uh, what a good counter would be. You should use 130point.com. I just dropped the link in the chat. You can see sold items there and um, what the buy it now price was, best offer price. We got Steve Largent, more Seattle, 82 out of uh, 99 for Hovsep. Nice Steve Largent. All right, a few more to go here.
Yeah, maybe. Yeah, Miami does have a lot of picks, so yeah, they could they could they could put together. They could have a really nice off season if they win the off season this year. You know, then then I think they could they could make some noise in the regular season. There's Daniel Jones to 75, and we've got Alshon Jeffrey, 34 out of 75. Going to Ryan Case and, and the fight in the fills. Daniel Jones for the Giants. That goes to Kyle. Behind Matthew Stafford is, is Colin Johnson. 35 out of 99. Another one for, no, number five. Ryan, Robert Runkle, that is, has number five. Jacksonville five. There's Calais Campbell, and he reveals a T. Higgins. Nice, 45 out of 49. That's a nice patch. Three-color patch, an on-card autograph. Hopefully we'll be hearing Burrow to Higgins for years to come. That goes to Roy and the Bengals. Two more to go. Steve Locke, what's going on? How are you? Nice, yeah. Kick back and relax, Steve. We are we are booked for the night, but I don't I don't know if you're in any of the upcoming breaks, but, but we are a little booked up for the night, but we've got some fun things coming up. Watch your T wolves fall short. Yeah, well, Brandon Richards are, is not happy with the Timberwolves because because they cover. I actually was on the Wolves plus five. That's the seventy-five. Eddie, oh, you're in Panini one. Yeah, that's coming up right after this. Nice. Seventy-nine out of ninety-nine. Stadium stars. Josh Jacobs. That's for my Raiders. That's going to go to Roy with my Raiders. Raiders need to need to reconstruct their offensive line. So they've cleared up some cap for. They've got to do some work too. We got limited ink. Jason Kelsey, twenty-four out of seventy-five. That's for uh, Philadelphia four. That's going to be for Ryan Kaysen. Yeah, Brandon had him in some sort of parlay. I guess he's not happy with Portland, more so. <laughs> yeah, Steve Locks like normally you do lose by far more than five. All right, uh, AJ Dillon going to Jay Goins, and the final three packs. Oh, there you go, Brandon. Nice. And a redemption back there. There you go. Yeah, I think Brandon's less happy with Portland than 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 Minnesota. All right, almost there, folks. Got Dak Prescott to 149, revealing a Cole Komet to 25. Bears are a number block team, so that's 15 out of 25. Bears five is Robert. Chicago five. Behind Saquon Barkley, hopefully he'll return healthy, is, that's pretty cool, Team Trademarks, Dante Culpepper. 
49 out of 99. That's for, that's Minnesota. And Minnesota 9 is going to be for Barry. Last spot mojo strikes again. There you go. Nice. Nice old school QB. The redemption is going to be Lynn Bowden Jr. Now, is he Dolphins edition in this set? Or did they still have him as Raiders edition? Go to cardboardconnection.com. Let's go to set checklist. Sometimes the base cards can be can still be, can be updated, but sometimes the ink is not updated. Lynn Bounder Jr. This is Dolphins edition in this one, so that'll go to Roy and the Dolphins. Just didn't work out in Vegas. All right. And there you have it, boys and girls. So now... Let's go back here. Actually, let's go back here and grab everybody's names from David down to Barry and everyone in between. Let's get your names over here. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Snake Eyes, two times for any of the non-numbered base cards that may be there for this group. There may be none, but I'm sure there are some. One and two. So Dale, Dale, there you go. Sorry, Dale, I don't think I called your name out too often in this, but I appreciate you getting in. You'll get any of the non-numbered base cards for that group of teams. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next break.